Nobody knows my sorrow. <laughs> Welcome everyone to the haunted mansion, or as we call it, the mansion. So glad you could join us here on this evening when we celebrate the most glorious night, Halloween! The night's so wonderful, we decided to make it 32 times. <laughs> or until the candy runs out, it never comes first. <gasps> never! Does anyone have any extra candy? Oh, yes! What do you have down there? Everything! Yes, some chocolates? Yes. <laughs> Something with nuts? A gin and tonic. Yeah, delish. <laughs> you are? Probably just as well. My doctor's got me on a strict diet, you know. Yes. Yeah. What's your diet? What's that? What's your diet? Uh, that's just it. <laughs> diet. <laughs> yeah. That's all I'm allowed to do. Oh well, could be worse. I could be working for the government. Uh, facts. Oh. What's in your hands? Right here, this is my tray and my bell. Oh. Yes, it's my ding a lingy. <laughs> Very nice. Isn't somebody else supposed to ring the bell for you? Oh, no. No? No, the bell tolls for me. <laughs> oh, and it tolls for Madame Renata. Oh, oh, you lovely vision. I've dreamed of your coming. Oh, so glad you could join me here. Come right on up. Well, the bench awaits you. Bottle of broom, it's the bottle of broom, everybody. Yes, well, they know that. They, no, I, I was the one you. that was here. You're the one oh, that's Oh, that's right. You want to let me remake that entry? Yeah, yeah. Oh, there she goes. All right. Again. All right, he was here already. I'm just <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. decaying brain. Uh, All right, I'm ready. All I'm ready. right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you <laughs> the most beautiful of the two sisters. <laughs> That's right, it's the lovely Renata. <laughs> Come right oh. over here. Oh, well, hello, everybody. Hello, and hello, the Broom. I've got the bench all disinfected oh, for you. I do thank you. Your sister was here earlier. Oh, I understand now. Uh, Decompetition. Yeah. It's happening. No. It's happening. Decay bombs everywhere. Yeah. yeah, right yeah. here in the mansion. Yeah. You know, I don't know what this whole fascination room is of living, gawking at us dead people. Yeah. If you want to join us, we're more than welcome to make that happen. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Oh, yes. Oh. Just send a telegram to the dead letter office. Yes? Yes. And we'll make sure you have an appointment right here in the mansion. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's like, what is it called? D-U-A? Dead upon arrival? Oh, uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's what it is. We just need y'all to be willing to die for us, and then all of a sudden, hook to the to do you're here! And uh, they could join me on my bench room. Oh, oh that's right. That's they could, I'll just, you know, I'll shimmy this. This, I call this my, it's, it's a debutante ball gown back in our day, but I think they all know it is a big fat gypsy wedding gown. <laughs> wow, oh, how no, ready to please. get married. Madam, don't kick up like that, no. Oh. You're killing the weeds. Oh, I'm yes. sorry, and I did have egg salad tonight. Oopsie yeah. doopsie do. <laughs> oh, you ate the egg salad? I did, it's poison, oh, you know. Oh, well, some people matter. can die twice, I suppose. <laughs> Oh, broom. Which came first, the chicken or the egg salad? Oh, my goodness, I think it was the hen. The hen? Yay. Yeah. Oh, the hen. That uh, hen. I, I could be wrong, though. Are any of you farmers down there? Farmer in the day, the farmer in... No, how about you? Because you're milking it. You know, it's harvest <laughs> time, you know. <laughs> I, I like him, though. You do? I do, I do. Oh, splendid. Well, all I, right then. Wait, can I ask you, do you like your eggs scrambled, boiled, that's hard boiled eggs, you know, oh, yeah, yeah. or egg salad? Eggs are good for you. 
Every way? No, 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 Broom. We don't want to talk to him. No, why he not? He likes deviled eggs. Oh, yeah. Broom. Especially on a night like this. Mm. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I'm, I'm singing in the heavenly choir, Broom. Are you really? Yes. Oh, well, they needed more baritones. Oh, they do. Oh, I've got a very low voice. Yeah, yeah. It's true. It's true. You know, Adele got nothing on me. Hello. <laughs> I love her, you know. I, I I visited Adele last night. She didn't know it, but I was there. You were there. Yes. How was I, she doing? But she was all right. She was watching Dance Moms. She was. Yes, I thought it was very peculiar. Adele myself. was watching Dance Moms. Adele Mom? was watching Dance Moms. I didn't know that she had an interest in dance. I didn't know shit. Who here likes dance? No, oh, yes. Oh, group, no, we could get dates to the ball now. No, oh, yes, yes, the waltz. Oh, I love the waltz. Yeah. You know, there's a waltz Disney I know upstairs. No, that's not. That's not. No, that's not. That's not, that's not oh, that's no. not. That, it's not him. No, that's it's not. not that, that, no. What are you talking about? No, no, the waltz. You know, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I just don't know why you have never got past three. It makes me very concerned about yes. you. Your education. I forgot you have trouble with math, madam. Oh, I've never been a forte. And what was your favorite subject in school? Was it science, perhaps? It was theater. Oh, theater. I love drama. Well, you are very dramatic, that's oh, true. Oh, I love, I like to take that word drama yes. and make it dramatic kill. Yes. Do you really? No, did you get that dramatic kill? No, oh, dramatic kill. Yes. Huh? <laughs> dramatic kill. Kill. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gracie's in the mansion. He's in the elevator. It's his regular hangout. But <laughs> <laughs> did you know? Did you know that um, he used to be a professional tightrope walker? I did not know that. It's true. It's true, Broom, and he got a little tangled. <laughs> did he really? <laughs> He's yeah. giving Rapunzel a run for her mommy. Well, I suppose so. <laughs> that was bad. That was bad. I should not say that. Yeah, my God. Uh, is that inappropriate? No, no, that's all right. It's all right. Some that's people right. are left. You are the niece of the master of the mansion. You can say whatever you like. Oh, Not good. like a servant. You have to watch everything we say. Then I'm going to tell you my two best friends are Sherry and Brandy. Okay. <laughs> Your two best friends are Sherry and Mandy? Yes, we're high on the spirits in there. Oh. <laughs> I thought these two down here by the uh, trash can were your favorite friends, right down there. Let me there. stand up. That's right there. Oh my goodness. See? Hi there! Oh look, it is Sherry and Brandy. That's Who said they right. had to be? That's right. That one's Sherry. Brandy. That was Brandy. Oh no, yeah. Are you fighting over your names now? That's Brandy. Paul. That's Brandy. That one's Sherry. Oh. I can't tell because they're twins, identical. Oh, are they really? Yes, they are. Oh. Just like me and my dead twin sister, Lady Carlotta. We were born the same day and yes. we died the same day, Broom. What a coincidence. Isn't, that, isn't it romantical? Oh, yes. I think it is. Your life is a constant a whirlwind of uh, amazing facts. Yes, and if, yes, it is. And if I might say so, life only gets better after you die. No, that's true, yes. Does that cancel each other out? I think oh, that yes. cancels each other out. My lumbago hasn't been acting up at all ever since I passed away. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, well, you should take out the music and rehearse it again. No, it's not. That's not what the lumbago? lumbago? No, the, the lumbago. It's a what? thing that I have. No. It's a... It's, never mind. Oh! His lumbago. We don't tip it if we talk about his lumbago. He's giving confessions. Yeah, just let him go. Tell us about your lumbago. Bro. I don't want to now. No, please. No, the you. moment's passed. Everybody, don't we want to hear about Broom's lumbago? Yeah. I thought he meant lumbago. Oh, right. Lumbago. Go ahead. Fine. It was horribly painful. Oh, no. Horribly painful. Oh, I spent my last remaining years walking with a limp and crawling to the doctor to get some sort of relief. Yes. And finally, I came here to the mansion yes. and I tripped over the welcome mat. Yes. So flat on my face and died and now I have no pain whatsoever. <laughs> you tripped over the welcome mat? Yes. Well, um, I'm, 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 I'm sorry that... <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't mean to laugh. Uh, I'm, no, it's not funny, lady. It's not funny. Please do not laugh at my pain. It's not funny. All we want to She's do She's giggling is... at my pain. All we ever want She's to... She's a pain giggler. All we ever want to do is make him feel welcome. <laughs> it worked. He stayed. <laughs> but don't giggle. I'm going to go back to Tom no. Sawyer's Island, you know. There's what? lots of room for me in the cave. Oh, 
Do you know, is that what you wanted to be if you ever grew, you know, got older and older and older? Did you want to be a caveman? Yes. Oh. Yes. Caveman. Is there any cavemen down here? There's very few of us left. Oh, there's one right over there. Yes, caveman, yes. You can always tell the cavemen they have hairy toes. They're ringing the bell again. They are. He's got the bell right there, but I think they want you back in the main ship. Mine is more musical. Yours is. Right. I like yours, Ben. Mm -hmm. It's like you a key of C. Oh, yeah. No, you can't have it. Oh. <laughs> well, if that is just rude. No. Marcus, I almost had it. Madam, my daughter, don't worry. I'll go fix you a hot toddy. How's that? Oh, I like that. Oh, I want to stay in a hot toddy. <laughs> No, that's not what I'm talking That's not, about. I'm sorry. Poor How, woman is wait, right. Did my, are my friend Sherry and Randy still there? Yeah. I think they left. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody give it up for Broom! <laughs> Broom. I'd like to find out his first name. I think that's why I'm going to make my, my challenge. Yeah, everybody shift on in here. Come on. Come, come, come on. I'm going to talk to these people over here. That's right. You're going to want to feel right up that you get... Get your bad self in here! Get, get, get! Oh wow, he's got a shiny head. I like it. See, I can see better when you're over here. You just lit up the room. Hi there. Is your name Sir Baldwin? As in the Baldwin brothers? Oh no, that's the Baldwin brothers. Hello, hello. It's me. It's Lady Renata. You say Renata, don't say Carlotta. I am Renata. I'm not Carlotta. Renata. Carlotta. I told you not to say oh. Carlotta. You don't take direction very well. My name is Lady Renata. For those of you just coming on into the mansion, and a hundred years ago, guess what happened? You died. You died. I died. <laughs> Go ahead, ask me how I'm doing. How are you doing? I'm dead. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look! Look, I'm like Dorothy in a tornado! <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we're in Kansas anymore! <laughs> oh, I love her! Judy and I, we're like besties up there, Judy Garland and I. Mm. It's true, sometimes she sings to me. It's so beautiful. We sing together in the heavenly choir. And she taught me her song. The one about over the rainbow. Mm -hmm. Did you know heaven's over the rainbow? Yeah. That's where I live. I don't live down there. Mm -hmm. I don't care if you do eat devil eggs. <laughs> I'm not joining you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. But she taught me the song. Somewhere over the rainbow. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. Oh. Sometimes she loans me her vocal cords. Because when you're a decaying corpse, you can just take them out. <laughs> Did I just say that? You know, we're having a revival upstairs in the heavenly choir. We're having a revival. It's true. We're doing the Wizard of Oz. <laughs> we finally have the original cast. <laughs> it's, was that bad? Mm -hmm. Who said wow? Was that Captain Get over your bad self? I'm hooked on you. Everybody's gotta die sometime. It's true. Everybody's got a side sometime. Even me. Captain Hook, what'd you say? Would you die for me? <coughs> you got the hook. I don't know. I have him. Oh my goodness. It's a miracle. <laughs> Captain Hook grew back his hand. <laughs> Well, whatever happened to that joke now? Now I can't say that you shot me at the second-hand store. <laughs> no, it's not anymore. <laughs> no, I just... I like that hook. That's why I had a crush on you. I was hooked on you, sweetie pie. Hooked, hooked, hooked. Like hooked on phonics. No, <laughs> I just had to say that because you got... Man, excuse me, stop that. No, this is a PG-rated mansion. Flashing not permitted. <laughs> Shame on you. Have you no sense of... What sense of what? Dignity. Modesty. Dignity is the word I'm... I have a decaying brain. I can't think of all the words at once.
had you no seats and taking that tape. Did I say it right? Yes, ma'am. Oh, you ma'am me? It's, Do I'm, I, from, I'm from the South, ma'am. Oh. I'm from the South. We, we ma'am and sir everyone. It started out as, oh, but I just did that nice note. I had to hold it a little bit. Oh, oh, pardon me. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> so anyway, where was I? Oh, Bob. But you know Carlotta got to him before me and she invited him to our debutante ball. Everybody say, oh no. Oh no. Oh yes. She took the love of my life away from me. Anyway, I decided I was going to get the first dance. And I thought if I could just get the first dance, then he would just fall madly and hopelessly in love with me. So I was sure to make the entrance first. And I, I walked out and I said, hello, everybody. It was like a sound of music moment. And they, they were waving to each other. I said, we're waving to each other. We're waving. Bro. We're waving to each other. Thank you. Give them direction down there. And then I said, hello, everybody. Hello. That's exactly what they said. It's as if you were there. So anyway, oh, stop it, Carla. It's my time to say this story. So anyway, where was, oh, yes. We made our entrance, and then I noticed him, Billy Bob. I'm gonna cast you as Billy Bob tonight. Hello, Billy Bob, or <laughs> hello, Billy Bob. Hi, Billy Bob. No, I said, hi, Billy Bob. Oh, that's what he said. <laughs> and when I said, Billy Bob, I'm, I, can you say just one dance for me? And then Carlotta came out. Carlotta came out. She had to ruin everything. And, and she said that I could dance with him over her dead body. And I said, well, that can be arranged. And well, I didn't mean it, though. I mean, I love my sister, but I sort of never had any grace. I, I wasn't the most graceful. Like, I like, was kind of like a hefty, hefty, hefty. I sort of, I don't know, maybe kind of, I bumped her. And she sort of maybe, I don't know, kind of went over the balcony. And she broke the banister. And she's dangling on for dear life. And she's holding on. She's holding on and she's screaming. I can hear her blood curdling screams just as if it were yesterday. She's yelling, Renata, Renata, help me! I'm falling and I can't get up. Yep, That's exactly what she said. We should be getting residuals on that little you know, phrase. Anyway, I looked at her and I said, I will certainly, most certainly help you up. If you'll just let me have one little bit of a dance with Billy Bob. And she said, no, he's my boyfriend. He's my date. And I said, but I want to ask you. We got in an argument. So I decided I'm just going to let her hang on for a little bit. I'm like, hang on a sec. So I started to go down the steps. And do you know what she had the audacity to do? What? She grabbed on to my gown. Everybody say, oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. yes. She grabbed on to my gown. And she just thought that I, when I went running down the steps, that I'd pull her up. Because, again, I'm hefty, hefty, hefty. We like to eat. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, it, it didn't happen that way. She pulled me with her. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Thank you for your sympathy. And we were like two torpedoes in the night. It's true, we splattered all over that dance room floor. Oh, they cleaned it up, which surprises me because they don't fix anything around this mansion. Anyway, anyway, that's not where it ends, though. Go ahead, ask me. What happened? Where does it end? Well, well, that was a lot of questions at once. <laughs> what? Ask me what happened to Billy Bob. What, what happened to Billy Bob? We landed on him. <laughs> Still won't talk to me. He's in that coffin. Did you all pass that coffin by Mama's banana? Yes. She's playing it for you. Her and Billy Bob are very friendly. I just get upset with that. Cause she just, she thought me and Carlotta could have behaved better on our debutante ball. But anyway, Billy Bob's in that coffin and he's shaking that lid. And everybody thinks that he's trying to get out and they get all scared and screaming out. He's not trying to get out, everybody. Don't you worry. He's just trying to stop me from getting in. <laughs> I know, I know. So next time you go into that mansion, can I ask you to do a favor? What? I can? Yeah. Can you all please say, Billy Bob? Billy Bob. Uh -huh. 
Get over it. Get over it. Death happens. Death happens. Everybody's gonna die sometime. It's true. Well, sing with me. Everybody's gonna die louder. Sing out, Louis. Sing it. Let Michael and Tammy one net and whoever else is present, let them all hear you. Everybody's gonna die sometime. It's true. It's true. It really is. Well, I said, well, I'm dead, but you might be joining me soon. Everybody's gonna die sometime. How about you? If we all could just admit death happens, get over it, move on. All right. I just think that, I think that the world is a wonderful place, especially when you're dead. You can go anywhere you want. Well, I was at Mr. Shiny's head over there. He really is Mr. Clean. I tried to leave him messages in the dust. I couldn't find any dust. The house was spick and span. Oh, not that you use that, sir. He's Mr. Clean. <laughs> but it was a very shiny house, so I, I hope you don't mind. I left some of my cobweb and spiders there just to make me feel a little more at home when I visit. And I love that you watch that Sister Wives show. On TLC, I sat there in the rocker in his living room. I was rocking, I was trying to get his attention, but he wasn't paying attention to the rock and rocker, the empty rock and rock. You'd think that would get someone's attention, <laughs> but it didn't. Anyway, I, I started, I'm watching that show, that, that Sister Wives show. I started thinking, this man's got a good thing going. Now, just because I'm dead doesn't mean I can't look. It doesn't mean I can't get married. I may have a decaying corpse and a decaying cornea and a decaying retina, but I'm still looking. And so I decided I'm gonna get married. Tonight might be the lucky night, but I'm not just gonna marry one man. I'm gonna marry two and three and four, just like that sister wife. And I'm gonna call them brother husbands. <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be great. It's, and you know what, there's another misconception that dead people don't eat. Does it look like I'm starving? No. You're not supposed to answer, it's very rude to answer no. that. <laughs> That was, that was rude. No, I'm just joking. No, that was really rude. No, I'm really joking. You can laugh. No, don't. <laughs> oh, so everybody, are you really having a good time? Because right now, I'm a little confused. And the way the bar is hitting this lady's head, she kind of looks like Statue of Liberty. It's all lit up. Oh, no, it's many years. Is it many years? Or are you the Statue of Liberty? When it's lit up like that, it looks like you have a beautiful crown. Give me your tires and your poor. We'll take anybody in here. We're not picky. No, we like everybody, isn't that right? Mm -hmm. that, is there anybody that's dead down there? No. I can't see. Oh, hi there, honey. How'd it happen? Oh my goodness. Are you from? <laughs> Here's Johnny! <laughs> it's the twins! I'm a twin! Although we were never as scary as you. I mean, I'm dead and you scare me. As dead people, we don't typically get scared. But when you see the two twins from The Shining, oh, hey, no. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> so tell me, how did you die? One of you tried to light the hotel with a pack of matches. Oh, which one? You just didn't... Sure it was. Oh, sure it was. You always have to blame everything on your sister, don't you? I believe you did it. What do they call that when you have fire under your seat? You got to do all that fire stuff. Pyromania. Pop, pop, pyro. Okay, I'll go with that. Maniac, I'll go with that too. Pyromaniac. She's a maniac. Maniac, pyromaniac, and she's acting like this girl is on fire. This girl is on fire. Too soon? <laughs> I'm sorry. Too soon. It's too soon. You can't. You can't talk about it. I didn't even see your little head there. Me? Are you beheaded like the headless horseman? No. Do you know? I think cousin Constance was married to the headless horseman because all her heads. Her husband? They don't have any heads. Does the ho and this horseman have a head? No. 
I think he could be one of her husbands. <gasps> think about it. Get back to me. Let me know. Let me know. Everybody, I think it's time for me to say goodbye, 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 goodbye. Whoa, cobwebs. I love that. Don't cry for me, living people. I love that song too. The truth is, I never left you. I went home with you last night. You didn't know it. Holy avatar, you're blue. <laughs> I never saw an avatarian up close and personal. Although I could, because I'm dead and I can haunt, but I never did. Did you have what the Smurfs have? Smurfomania? Lack of oxygen. So I think what they're trying to tell me is the Smurfs and Avatarians are dead? They're just ghosts and they didn't even know it? This is getting in very interesting, Eve. Are you getting a picture of my nostrils, lady? <laughs> Let me tell you, the boogeyman is not up there.